Focus Group this weekend. Um, obviously, you're desperately looking to get uh, the three points. How important is it, do you feel, that you start to get the points this weekend? Yeah, last weekend we get also points, a uh, point, but uh, not the three points. And, and this weekend, I think this is also uh, must be the target. The three points is every weekend is the target. The three points, so um, we can talk about uh, four games unbeaten, but uh, this doesn't help you because you you lost. You can tell you lost four points, you know, in the last two games, and for this reason now uh, we want also. Uh, that uh, the gap uh, between the first and us will be not uh, huge for this season. You you have to deliver. You have to try to win the three points uh, to be concentrated uh, to fight for this. Yeah. This is uh, is a massive game for us. Yeah, for I think it was also for Falkirk because. Yeah, I'm bottom in the league and yeah, also desperate to win the, 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 the home game. But uh, for this reason, it will be an interesting game because both teams here, yeah, uh, he need the three points. It's not so just, uh, uh, yeah, happy with truth, you know. Uh, we are not happy, he will be not happy for this reason. I think both teams, he will do everything to, to win the game. What do you think it is that will make the difference, do you feel, to get the three points? <laughs> The difference, what makes the difference to get the three points? The, the difference if, if you get the three points, you are very close to the first uh, place, uh, and, and if you not, um, yeah, the gap will be uh, bigger, and this is what we don't want. But, but it, it, look, uh, it, uh, it's, uh, every time uh, is the same. Uh, even against Morton, uh, we don't uh, uh, we don't want to. Have just a draw, you know, especially not at home, and and uh, especially after uh, Aloha, uh, we uh, rose uh, in these two games generally uh, very very uh, close uh, to this, uh, let's say, up and down, you know, against Aloha. In the last minute, uh, you get a, 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 yeah, you consider the goal, and then it's uh, my God. Now, if you take reverse, uh, in the last minute you scored against Morton, and even you was not happy. So you see that uh, you see that the, the, uh, even you score goal and you take a draw, uh, you can't be happy. You know, uh, you have to go even to score more goals than uh, and, and and just take the, the victory and take the three points. That's that's the most important. Yeah. And obviously, Ray McKinnon is now the manager at Falkirk, and Dundee United haven't come up against him since he left the club. What sort of reception do you think the fans will give him? I don't know. It's, it's, um, I don't care about it. I just want uh, to see that we go out and we play uh, our game. and. I don't uh, care about uh, uh, who is the, the uh, other manager or not. Uh, we have to do, and I just concentrate about my job. You're only three points off the top of the league at the moment. Some of the fans' groups are being kind of voicing their opinion to put pressure on your job. Do you feel there's pressure on your job at this moment? Right, it's always a pressure, you know. If you are <laughs> the manager from Dundee United, uh, you are. At the moment, uh, everybody they just to win every game, uh, uh, to uh, play uh, also very nice football, to score maybe five or six goals, and uh, to win the league. I wish the same. Yeah. I wish the same. So, do you have, do you have uh, a message for these doubters? Uh, look now, uh, because uh, the message uh, can give uh, just uh, the team. Because uh, if you win the game, I think also the fans will be happy. So uh, that is what uh, what we what we have to do, in, and uh, just uh, to work uh, definitely in direction, uh, win the game, uh, make the fans make the winning game happy, and, and uh, that's all. Uh, I think this is the best uh, message uh, if you if you show that. Uh, you are fighting, and I was also uh, uh, for the victory, and I was also uh, honestly uh, very uh, uh, happy after the game uh, for one reason, not that uh, we uh, lost two points, I was really unhappy that we lost the two points, 
uh, but on the other side, uh, that make me uh, also uh, happy to see that the team, uh, until the last minute he are fighting, he want to come back and show, even if it's the uh, positive or the negative noise, he closed just the, the ears and he told, okay, we go and we go so long, how long is possible to score one goal, and this means that the, the team he, he is fighting, you know, uh, and the team is alive and the team he tried to do everything, you know, even for the fans, for the club, for his own. And that is the most important for me uh, uh, to see that you have some time, uh, really games in which one, uh, like against Morton in the first minute, no, okay, not first, I suppose, I think that fourth or third minute we get a, a penalty uh, against us. Uh, he scored. Uh, he went uh, uh, just uh, for counter attack. He stand behind. He tried to defend this 1-0, uh, which one he done also uh, really, really good. The, gun, uh, the, the goal he come too late, but uh, the frustration uh, was not there from the team. He tried, he tried, he tried, he tried until the end. And this is this is good. Yeah, this is good that he made it. And for this reason, I just told also in the dressing room that uh, I can't be uh, uh, angry about you guys. Uh, I am angry that we lost the, uh, the two points, but uh, you showed that you are alive, you know, and, and you, you try hard and you try it hard and you get no the one points, that's not uh, good enough, the next game uh, must be the three points, but uh, that's life, yeah. Shala, uh, it was great to see Fraser finally back in the first team and scoring. How important a player could he be for you this season? Uh, I think uh, the phase of five, he, uh, he showed uh, in these 20 minutes how important player is here for the club, you know, not, not, not just for me, it's for the club uh, and for me too, because I think uh, he gave an uh, option in the middle field and, uh, you know, also the most uh, people uh, with who I talked, uh, he told me that um, if last season uh, we don't lose uh, a phase of five, he, yeah, uh, Today we are not in the championship because mid Fraser Five, even the last season, uh, you can uh, and you had uh, definitely uh, a big blow, but uh, losing him. But uh, in this season, uh, he showed already uh, in the first game how important player is, you know. And um, at the moment, it's also uh, clear that he is not ready for 90 minutes. Yeah, uh, and we are trying to build him up, uh, but. Uh, that's uh, it's normal. Uh, I don't uh, want to to force no for one or two games, and then after to lose him again, we have to give him the time which one he needed uh, to be uh, really part of the team for 90 minutes. You will be encouraged to see Louis Toshny scoring for the reserves recently. Um, he's obviously had a very tough time through injuries. What's what's the latest with his situation? And how is he? Yeah, he is. Uh, he tried uh, just uh, also just now with the, with the reserve team. Um, yeah, in the last 20 minutes he, sh he scored even the goal against Rangers, but uh, he's uh, at the moment very, very far uh, to play, uh, unfortunately, for the, for the first team. Uh, we have to wait that uh, how it looks now, the knee uh, tomorrow after tomorrow. He tried also uh, for a couple of months uh, in the same way. Uh, uh, he went also in the loan and, and uh, he came back because um, after 90 minutes game he get again a swollen knee. So at the moment it's very, very early after this 20 minutes to, to give a statement about Toshni. This is so that uh, he's 26 yeah, uh, uh, and uh, it's, a, it's a sad story that with 26 you know uh, you have to fight. Uh, with your healthiness, with your knee, uh, to don't uh, lose uh, uh, the job in the professional football. Uh, we protect him, we give him everything which one he uh, really uh, need uh, so far, how far we can give him the help, but, uh, but uh, at the moment it's too early to make a statement that he is no is good and he can train with the first team or he can be a part from the first team. He is generally a part from the, our squad because he have a contract too, uh, but actually uh, it's not so far to be uh, really 
in the Bay of Kinawa Games. Yeah, I mean, it, it, there, there was a newspaper claiming that there might be a question mark against Lewis's career. Is that inaccurate? Then? Ah, this is. Uh, I and look, I am not a doctor, and I don't uh, wish really to 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 tell that his career is is finished. I wish uh, really that uh, maybe somehow he can continue his uh, football career. I think. Uh, and I know what about I am talk. I was talking. I was also 26, I uh, 25 even. So like in the same age like Toshny, and I had uh, to give it up, uh, you know, because this knee injury. And uh, I know which kind of feeling you have uh, in this moment. Um, you uh, you want. Uh, you feel that you are good, you feel that physically you can do, you can. You feel that mentally you can do, but somehow uh, part of the, your body uh, he don't want, you know, and, and uh, this is unfortunately the knee. Uh, and, and you know, for the football player the knee is this the most, or sometimes the one from the most dangerous part, which one if it's damaged. Uh, you, you can't handle this uh, properly and, and all the time you have uh, in, in, in your mind this psychologically pressure that oh, it can happen again something but on the other side the love to the football, to the sport is there and, and uh, yeah, uh, you push you. Um, at the moment what I told you before I want just to give uh, every uh, help uh, for Toshni uh, to come back to try, but uh, at the end of the day, uh, this is his decision, uh, what he wants to do, how he wants to do, he feels the knee, uh, I wish him to come back. Yeah. And Sam Stanton and Nicky Clark, how close are they to the uh, first team? Yeah, the, uh, Sam Stanton next week, he can train already, he's made the first team uh, after the operation surgery, uh, he has uh, really uh, uh, no more pain. Uh, it's very good. He trains today, uh, not with us, but uh, he's uh, next week uh, with us. If don't uh, happening, nothing. Uh, and uh, Nicky Clark too. Uh, it's also good news. So that the Billy King, uh, I think, is uh, he's ready. He will be part of the team again uh, for Kirk. Uh, so that um, this is a good news that. Look, if we have back uh, Nicky Clark, Billy King, and uh, also uh, Fraser Fifey uh, permanently, I think uh, now the injury uh, situation is uh, is more better than it was before, mm -hmm. and we have also more possibilities uh, definitely. Um, which one make also competition, you know, more higher. Now uh, this is what we what we need. Yeah.